What's up, YouTube? We're doing another Mini Cooper. It's a 2014 Countryman. Yeah. Four door. Customer brought it in for the hood. Bonnet would not open. The interior handle was already busted. This is the second one I've come across doing this to. Um, and here's what I found that worked the best. Obviously, we have the hood open. So on the passenger side front, you want to take the tire off and remove the fender skirt assembly. And then you should have access to the latch, which is right up inside there. Now we have the spring popped off from monkeying around with it to try and get in there. You see the cable uh, right there in that image and the release arm is all the way to the left. That is not released, it needs to be to the right. So that means that that latch assembly is sticking. Similar issue exactly on the driver's side, but you cannot get it through the fender well. What you need to do is go underneath the vehicle and look straight up. There's just about enough room that you can get to the latch underneath the coolant bottle. Uh, you're gonna need something long to get in there and release the arm assembly in there to get the hood to pop. So you'll see it's probably almost in the release position, but it's not, you wanna push it over and wedge the hood up so it actually pops the hood up uh, while you're working on at least the one side of the latch. Same process for the other side. You wanna get under there and wedge the hood with a little something with some pressure. And then once you get the arm where the cable is pushed through, you can see how it's right there. Yep, the rear stranglers. And you wanna slide the arm to the left. It's gonna be hard for me to show you, but this is the easiest way to get the hood open. Then you can replace all the necessary parts to fix it. Thanks for watching.